Opposition spokesperson on education, Angela Brown Burke, is calling for intervention for parents who have been unable to send their children back to school since the start of the new school term. She gave her suggestion during her contribution to the 2022-2023 sectoral debate in Parliament on Wednesday. Dr. Brown Burke says parents have a responsibility to ensure their children attend school. She adds, however, that with the various impacts of the COVID-19 pandemic, the Education Ministry should ascertain the reasons for students' absence from school. Where we have children employed and earning, helping to defray the costs of providing for the family. What do you say to a student who says he's not registered for an external exam anyway? So why should he go back to school when he's actually earning? What do you say to parents who have lost their jobs and their daily hustle just cannot put food on the table, but their children are now picking up the slack? Can you imagine how distressed these parents must be? This certainly could not have been the dream they had for young Chelsea at 14 to be out of school and pregnant nor for young Raheem to be rubbing out him in the middle with the youths around the corner. The Ministry of Education and Youth has established a yard-to-yard -yard Find the Child initiative. The initiative, which began in January, is slated to identify, locate and re-engage students. Portfolio Minister Favel Williams explained to Parliament on January 11 that through this initiative, 580 youth workers under the whole program and 108 social workers will be engaged to complement the school-based teams at 478 public schools island-wide to go yard to yard to find students and to re-engage them with their schools so that they can continue their learning. The opposition spokesperson on education is suggesting an expanded planned intervention. What about providing guidance and support to these youngsters? What about cushioning the crisis for them and their families and helping them lift their head above water? What agencies have been asked to intervene to deal with the specific circumstances? Madam Speaker, the financial position of many families is dire.